Hey everyone. Hey, <laughs> I wasn't talking to you, Delilah and Jericho. I was talking to the people on YouTube and Facebook. <laughs> the puppies have been cooped up in their crates for a little while because I had a crochet class tonight. But hey, you guys, don't be nipping me, Sheba. There. They are so such good babies. I, I do put them in a crate when I have a crochet class because we set up class right here in the living room. And most people love dogs, but might not love six of them. <laughs> and, but everybody that comes here is just always so impressed that they lay there and chew on their treat or whatever it is I'm giving them and just are really good. But boy, as soon as they get out of that crate, they're giving it to me, aren't you, Dee Dee? You, you have been rotten to me all day. She's been picking on everybody, and uh, including me today. It's just ornery girl. She's an ornery puppy. Hey, what are you two up to? Jerry Coco? Sheba Sheba? <laughs> oh, they're good babies. They're real good. They've been good all day. They've got to play outside and burn up some energy. And uh, they've just been laying around and chewing on their bones or getting all rowdy. And Hey, we don't bark at the door. You know better. Don't you do that. Don't you do that. Dad got home. They got all excited because Dad's home. And... Uh, that's just all that's going on here. The yard is all muddy, so I've mopped several times today when they come tracking it in and keep the rugs washed up and the towels. <laughs> we keep a towel down for them. But we're really amazed with Chloe and Candace and how good they are about going to the door now. They're not perfect. They're still having some... Uh, accidents in the house but they are going to the door when they need to and uh, when we open the door for everybody to go out most of the time they get right in line and want to go too so um, now if, uh, dad can just get them to quit pottying right on the deck that would be a good thing so <laughs> but they're getting better they're getting house trained and it won't be long and they'll be where they prefer to go outside instead of uh, inside, I hope. But everybody's doing good. We're still watching Sheba. I don't know about her. Uh, she hasn't really changed. She doesn't act any way at all. I tried looking at her gums. They say that the gums get paler, but I don't know with pregnancy. I just want to hurry up and get to her uh, ultrasound appointment because I want to know. I just want to know that we have more puppies on the way. I'm pretty sure we should have, but as far as just watching her, I can't really tell any difference. Uh, I've had girls in the past who I was pretty sure I saw signs of morning sickness not long after mating and breeding, but with her I haven't noticed anything, so we'll just have to wait and see. <laughs> but we're looking forward to if if uh, for some reason she didn't get pregnant, we will wait. Uh, Delilah will be ready again later like in march i believe and then ray ray will be coming in around may so i do know we're gonna have a couple of more litters this year probably three is what i'm thinking so i'll keep everybody updated i'm just anxious i want to know for myself as soon as possible they're just still chewing on their bones that they got for a treat yesterday They'll chew on those bones for several days. Uh, and anyway, they're just doing good. And that's that's all. Hey, are you chewing on the couch? No, no, no. No couch chewing. No.
Oh no, Missy. Nah. <laughs> That's what the bones are for. Get you a bone. There you go. Good girl. Anyway, that's what we're doing at Bogan's Bustin's. Watching the dogs chew on the bones. <laughs> yeah.